even get it up to the roof. Everybody thought it was safe. Welcome back guys. Now that we have all the subfascia installed on that center section up there, we can begin cutting out all the doors and windows. Yeah, and once that's done, we're gonna install all the fascia board over the subfascia and uh, tape all our seams over the joints of the OSB and start flashing the windows. Yeah, window, how you like me now? That's a pretty nifty tool. Look at that. One down, five more to go. It looks so good. We got all six of our windows cut out right here now. You can see that we do have some places that we need to go back through and nail just because we wanted to minimize the number of shiners that we got. So we just need to go back around the windows and fix up some of those spots. Finish nailing those those few spots around the windows where I couldn't see initially where the, the yeah. stud was. But yeah, all of them are cut out. Looks really good. Uh huh. Now for the front door. All right, now that we have all the windows and doors cut out up there, we are going to begin installing the fascia. Activate Spidey Spence. Oh my gosh, so much for a graceful landing. <laughs> Now that that fascia board is up there, before we start on that roof deck, we're gonna work on taping and flashing the windows and all the seams of the uh, OSB. Before we 
uh, are able to do that, we have to clean up on top of uh, the containers because there's still some dirt and lots of sawdust up there, especially on this side where we cut out the windows. All right, so how I'm going to be flashing our windows is by using this Henry's air block. It's a air and water flashing, liquid apl uh, fluid applied flashing. Um, so basically all you do is heavily apply it into the seal and about three inches out and just uh, use a spatula and smear it out. And I'll, but I'll go ahead and show you guys all that. And another thing I want to note is this uh, bottom plate, the sill plate here, we actually, most people build them flat, but what we did was we shimmed it up just a little bit. So if any water does happen to get behind the window and land on the sill, it'll hit this uh, fluid applied flashing and gravity will just take it on out. We have had this question asked so many times, so I'm gonna finally answer it. I, I've said stuff about it in previous videos, but it's just continuously asked, so I'm gonna just answer this question. What are you gonna do about the flat roof of the containers and water hitting the, the wall? What we're gonna do is, first of all, there's gonna be a pitched roof that'll come up to about, uh, I forget the exact measurement we calculated, but roughly somewhere right in here and it'll pitch down. It'll be roughly a 212 pitch. At the seams, not only are we going to spray foam uh, all the inside, but we're going to fill the gaps with spray foam, closed cell spray foam. And then on the outside, we're going to flash all these little uh, ridges with the fluid applied because the fluid applied is elastic. So it it uh, it's able to stretch and compress with the the materials and from what the product label says you can use it on prime steel and on osb so perfect for our scenario hope that answers any questions <laughs> wait a second what? so you're telling me that when you flash the windows that wasn't a way to prevent water or air getting into the house when you flash the windows for sure that would have worked. All right, so the liquid flashing on that far side isn't fully dry right now, so we're gonna go ahead and actually start putting the zip tape on the front right here. Okay guys, it felt like it took forever, but we are finally done installing all of the zip tape up there. You can see there's a ton of it. <laughs> we have it covering all of our cracks up there over every nail just to try to maximize the efficiency 
of our home. And there's more tape on the bottom of that wall up there. It's just, you can't see it from down here. But yeah, that stuff is sticky. Holy crap. Watch out for our next video as we begin building the roof deck and I can finally see all our hard work paying off. God, I feel like a doof. <laughs> yeah, window! <laughs> Well, I gotta take them off then, they're so long. <laughs>